morning and welcome to WSRH News, your leading source for news at Seminole Ridge High. I'm Jordan Lewis. And I'm Sheila Stewagen. Today is Wednesday, August 17th. We got a lot to tell you about this morning, but first, today's top story. Seminole Ridge is home to dozens of clubs, and today our Student Government Association wants you to join one, or maybe more. SGA is sponsoring a special club rush event during both lunches today. WSRH News reporter Kara Tubb has more on the story. I heard there's an SGA club rush today. I'm here with Mr. Crimmins. Now, Mr. Crimmins, what is it about? So club rush is essentially telling students what clubs are available on campus, what sports, what organizations. Just give them a little more insight about like what are campus. How many clubs do you plan on having today? Today, I believe as of this interview, about 13, maybe 15. And what lunch is going to be? We'll be doing it during both A and B lunch. Where at each one? It will be located right outside the cafeteria. It should be lined up around, and there is one table at the white table. Thank you, Mr. Jones. Have fun today. For WSRH News, I'm here at home. You must have a parking decal to park in the student parking lot. Student parking information and registration is located on our school's website. Please complete all requirements and check your email for parking confirmation. Before going to student services to pick up your decal, you are allowed to park on campus until you are approved. Approval may take one to two school days. Students found parking without a valid decal will receive parking violations or subject to towing. Also, student drivers who are consistently tardy to school may have their parking privilege suspended or revoked. Remember, student parking is a privilege. Seniors, now is the time for you to get your senior's photo taken for the yearbook. You can schedule your seno photo session at kettystudios.com. There is a minimum sitting fee of $30 that must be paid online. The first date that the senior photos can be taken is September 3rd and appointment times are filling up fast. If you have any questions on how to sign up for senior photos, please speak with Mr. Bell in room 7110. Zero, or go online to the school's website and look at the yearbook page for detailed instructions. Are you a senior and want to paint your parking spot? Well, now you can. You just have to go to room 6101 and get an application. The price will be $15. Students must be clear of obligations, already have purchased a parking spot, and have at least a 2.2 GPA to be eligible to paint. The painting will take place September 17th from 8 to 11 a.m. Students must purchase their own materials. All painting ideas must be approved by Mr. Crimmins and cannot include negative or rude language, description of fire alarms, acronyms, and other listed in contract. Any student interested in Dance Marathon Leadership Team, please pick up an application and interview time slot for Mrs. Ahmad in room 5102 or Mr. Gomez in 5107. The deadline to apply is today, and the kids can't wait for your involvement. Are you totally impressed by our awesome te step team? Do you want to be part of the one most fun, spirited, and admired groups on campus? Trials for the 2022 to 23 step team will be held after school on August 30th and 31st in room 3103. No previous experience is required. Contact Ms. File with questions. Enemy Club will have its first meeting August 30th. All are welcome to join right after school till four in room 7110. If you are interested in the first priority club, there is a meeting this Friday, August 19th at three o'clock p.m. in room 9103. Have you always wanted to learn sign language but never had the chance to? ASL's club first meeting of the year will take place on Thursday, August 18th at 3 p.m. in room 4211. This is an informational meeting on what the club is about. Come to the meeting and learn about what we can do. Students, are you looking for a new club to join? Are you interested in poetry slams and freestyle Fridays? Are you looking for a club where you can be your most authentic self and openly express your thoughts and views on issues in a chill vibe environment? Then come out and join the Black Student Union. For more information, please see Ms. Wright in room 3203. Safe Promise Club's first meeting of the year will take place today, August 17th, at 3 p.m. in room 4211. This is an informational meeting on what the club is about. Do you want to stop bullying in our school? Come to the meeting. Coming up on WSH News Birthdays, plus today's sports. Hey, bro. You want to hit this? Isn't that bad for you? Nah, dude. It's safe. Don't you trust me? Well, if you say so. Want to hit this? Isn't that bad for you? Nah, bro. Don't you trust me? <laughs> well, if you say so. The chemicals found in jewels and other e-cigarettes contain the same harmful metals like lead that are present in gasoline. Visit www. What did one volcano say to the other? What? I love you. Let's go to WSOH meteorologist Jamie Allison with today's forecast. Good morning, Hawks. 
For today's weather forecast, we have a high of 94 and a low of 75, and it's partly sunny. For the three-day forecast, it's going to be partly sunny throughout Thursday. On, we have a high of 94 and a low of 75. On Friday, we have a high of 92 and a low of 77. And on Saturday, it's going to be a high of 91 and a low of 78. That's it for WSRH News. I'm Jamie Allison. We have a happy birthday going out to Arissa Beverly, Ayana Deborte, Angela Garcia Dominez, Michelle Merlin, Jasmine Ochea, and Sailor Ruiz. Happy birthday. WSA sports anchor Jordan Mansell joins us now at the desk. Sports to talk about today. Let's get right to it. This week, our varsity football team kicks off with a preseason game against Martin County. WSR sports recorder Dakota, Dakota Parks has the preview. I'm here with head coach of the football team, Coach Tifolo, to talk about this Friday's game. So, Coach Tifolo, who are you planning to play this game? Uh, this Friday, we play uh, Martin County High School, which is a team that we played in the regular season last year. So, we're gonna we schedule them for our preseason game. Uh, this game is primarily for us to see. Uh, how much we've learned over the summer since spring. Um, obviously, we always uh, will have our starters in or the projected starters for the season for the first half, probably the first three quarters. And then uh, towards the second half of the game, try to get as many guys in as possible because uh, it's an evaluation game for us, right? That's pretty much what preseasons are, is to see what we have, who's capable of doing what, and uh, allowing us to kind of put game plans and people in the right places for future games. Who are going to be some standouts this year? Well, uh, we got a lot of standouts. Um, one was just mentioned the other day on the announcements. Evan Jackson is our uh, safety. He just got named to the uh, ESPN Top 63 list for seniors in Palm Beach County and Treasure Coast. Uh, we got his brother Ty. We've got guys like Thomas Garbowski, Hunter Goss, Ruben Tirado, um, Louis Gonzalez. I mean, I don't want to leave people out, but I mean, um, no, we've got a lot of good guys. Uh, there'll be a lot of new faces in a lot of different positions this year, but um, everybody's been working their tails off uh, to earn those spots. So um, I'm, I'm excited to see how they all do. And what are your outlooks for this season? The outlook is always good. Uh, these guys have been putting a lot, like I said, they've been putting a lot of work in, uh, committing their entire summer uh, to come here. Uh, they've been here, we've all been here four days a week, Monday through Thursday, all summer long. Uh, for two, three hours, um, working out, running, conditioning, lifting, um, putting in game plans, things like that. So, um, you know, the, like I said, if we go out there and do what we're supposed to do and execute, um, I'm pretty confident we'll be all right this year. Thank you for taking the time to talk to us. And with WSRH News, I'm Dakota Parks. Today there will be an informational meeting for anyone who wants to play fall baseball. It will be in the media center and start at 3.15 p.m. Boys golf tryouts are underway and will continue through August 19th at 3.30 each day at Madison Green Golf Club. If you have any questions, see Coach Tiemann in room 7213. Taking a look at today's sports calendar, there are no sports today, but on Friday, the varsity football team hosts Martin County. Kickoff is at 6.30 p.m. Good luck, Hawks, and that's all for WSRH Sports. I'm Jordan Mansell. For, for SRH News, I'm Shayla Stowagen. And I'm Jordan Lewis. Remember that you can follow us on social media, on Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube at Seminole Ridge TV. Have a great day, Hawks.